In the Scotland on Android tutorial series, we're going to learn how to find out if our device has a network connection or not. Welcome to Mobile Application Tutorials, my name's Nigel. Okay, as part of the Google API series, we need to have a network connection, so we need to check to see if that network connection is available or not. And this follows on from the previous tutorial series where we check to see if the Google Play services were installed or not. Um, if you wanna sign up for my free membership, you will get the documentation here. Um, and it will have the details inside the GitHub repo of how to get the code from the previous tutorial if you just want to start on this tutorial. But I do recommend you do the full series, of course. And for the uh, premium members on the professional plan, they will have a little helper video provided to them as well, showing them how to get the code from the previous tutorial. Okay, anyway, we'll make a start on how to check to see if we've got network connection or not. So we'll go into our Android Studio. I am going to add a new function down here and I'm just going to say is network available and it will return a boolean type Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is create a value to represent the connective connectivity manager. So I will call this connectivity manager. Connectivity. Yeah, I think that's a great spelling. I'll change it later in GitHub if it's not. Okay, so um, we need to call the get system service from Android in the context here and we call the connectivity service okay that that system is a generic value that does need to be casted in the type of a connectivity manager so what I'm going to do here is call Kotlin smartcast so if connectivity manager is which is the notation for a Kotlin smartcast connectivity manager if this is successful um, we will now have connectivity manager of our variable we will be of the type connectivity manager so we can call connectivity manager actually I'm just going to create another value down here and I'll call this network info call our connectivity manager and we get the a variable active note active network info okay I'm getting a warning here so I'm just going to click on that um, see what it's saying here okay so it says I need the permission basically access network state so we'll add that now into our Android manifest file and so we need to add the permission access network state close the tag there go back into our file and the warning's gone away okay now I'll add a new line down below here and we'll call network info is connected which will tell us that anyway let's complete a statement to return false okay so we're still not returning anything but this if else statement represents an expression it returns a value so in Kotlin, we can just put the return in front of the expression to return a value. It's highlighted that. Don't worry, it's not an error. Okay, so that function's now completed. We'll add that into our preconditions here and update the code, then run it just to check to see if the network connection's there as well as the Google Play services. So I'll put an else if and I'm going to check to see if is network not available and I'll just update the value the status button there and we need to call resources get string 
uh, dot id. I'm going to add a new string here. Network not available. Okay, I need to create that there. I'll just drag this across into my main screen so you can view it. And I'll just set this say there is no network, network, currently no net. What do they say in the network providers? Currently no network available. Save that. I'll add that later to Git. Okay, and I just want to update the string here just to indicate that we've now got Google Play services installed and we have an active network. So I'll change that to saying uh, GPS net network um, GPS network available. And add a new string for that saying, unfortunately, this keeps getting dragged across the wrong one. Of them. Okay, and I'll, add in, I'll just add some more information saying Google Play Services, and hope this is not too big for our pattern. Network is available. And save that. And I've got a little error there. I must have done a little typo. We need to change ID to string. Ooh, and I'll just update that now and fix the other, other issue behind the scenes. Okay, our network is not available. Okay, code looks all good, so we'll run that and check to see if we've got network connection. Okay, the application's now started. I just need to click on the button. And it is telling me that we now have Google services and network availability, so we're making good progress into being able to access our Google APIs. And that completes this Kotlin on Android tutorial, how to check to see if your device has got network connectivity or not. If you want to get notified of following tutorials or the tutorials that I'm working on, don't forget to click on that subscribe button. If you want to get access to all the episodes currently right now and for getting access to the Google APIs, you can sign up to the free membership plan for $10 a month. There is a card for that as well as a link in the description. If you don't have the free membership, I do offer free membership on the site as well, which gives you access to this documentation if you want to follow that around as you're doing the tutorial. Anyway, thank you for taking the time for watching this one. Bye for now.